operators, also trained and certified, work to maintain and repair hydrants, valves, and water mains. They take special care to keep our drinking water safe and keep it flowing through miles and miles of underground pipeline, the transportation system for our public water supply. The water tower is perhaps the most visible and familiar part of public water systems. Regularly inspected and maintained, water towers and ground storage reservoirs do two things. First, they keep plenty of water ready for our use, so it's there especially when we need it most. Second, they provide water pressure, either by gravity or by mechanical pumps. Pressure makes the difference between a gush and a trickle. All along the way, from its carefully assessed natural source, through the regulated treatment process, and down the complex distribution system, public drinking water is closely monitored, protected, and secured. When the water reaches the service lines in our homes, schools, and businesses, you can be sure that it meets strict standards, is of the highest possible quality, and safe to drink. Keeping rates reasonable is one more goal of public water supply systems. By routinely inspecting every part of the system, with ongoing investments in maintenance, repairs, and improvements, we can add years to the useful life of our public water facilities. Rate increases are necessary as demand for water grows, as infrastructure ages, as regulations increase, and as security concerns rise. But with all that goes into making our water safe, reliable, and secure, it's still one of the greatest values around. And best of all for our budgets, there's no need to spend dollars buying water at the store. For just pennies a day, safe public water is delivered, ready at the touch of a finger for instant on-site use or to fill up and go. Remember though, there's never any new water. Some of what we use seeps right back into the groundwater. Some goes down the drain as wastewater. Wastewater is treated too and then returned to the water cycle. As water falls through the air and runs over the land, it picks up substances put there by animals or by human activity, like viruses and bacteria, salts and chemicals, air emissions, as well as pesticides, herbicides, and fertilizers, substances that may reach our rivers, lakes, streams, and groundwater. Keep it out, not take it out. That's the aim of source water protection programs, storm sewer control and sewer separation projects, land use, zoning and environmental regulations, and community recycling efforts. It's just plain common sense, and it's up to each of us individually to do our part to comply and participate. Because after all, it's the only water we'll ever have. To find out more about what you can do, call the Illinois Environmental Protection Agency. The people, the plants, the process, the pipelines, the protection. Illinois public water systems, whether they serve large or small communities, all have the same goal, to deliver to you, when and where you need it, sparkling clean, safe drinking water.